How does the offense kind of get back on track to where you guys were early in the season? Uh, I mean, we just got to do, uh, do the little things. Um, and, I mean, the, obviously the little things are the big things. Uh, we got to, uh, you know, we have to just hammer it in in the red zone. Um, just do everything to get back to uh, what we're used to doing, um, you know, when we're on those runs and stuff like that. And I think it's, it's definitely fixable and, uh, you know, we'll get it going. When you go against a defense that likes to play like a singular kind of coverage, like last week you know they wanted to play a lot of cover two, this week you know they want to play a lot of cover three, how does that change how you kind of go about it when you kind of know they want to do this but they're really good at doing this at the same time? How does? Well, I think you got to go into every game, um, you know, obviously saying they – you know, this coach likes to do this, but, you know, they, they could always change it. Uh, they could always uh, switch it. So I think, um, obviously, you have uh, plays that'll, that will attack uh, that particular defense, but then you still have uh, plays for different coverages, you know. So um, a lot of t um, there's a lot of times in, the, in this league that you think somebody's playing one and they play the other the whole game. So um, I think, you know, just us, ha um, you know, being within the offense and, um, and just us executing um, um, what we have to do, I think that's all we have to do. How have you seen kind of the guys in the locker room kind of respond after, you know, the highs where you get those yeah. victories on the road and then the lows losing last week? Uh, I think, I think we've, uh, everybody's been responding well, you know, just because we know uh, the work at hand um, and we know what's in front of us and everything is still in front of us, um, everything that we want to accomplish. So I think when you look at that and look at, you know, what type of team we are, um, um, we just have to get back to doing us um, and then we'll be good. How have you seen Trevor grow since he got here to Jacksonville? Well, I mean, easy. You know, it's, you know, I think every game, and that goes for everybody in the league, every game that you play, uh, every snap that you uh, that you take, you know, uh, you get you get you get more and more wise, uh, uh, you know, so to say. Um, but yeah, just the, just in terms of the command, um, you see that um, the preparation. Um, you know, he knows what he has to do to prepare himself. Um, so those uh, those things are are, are definitely uh, things that stick out. What makes operating in the red zone besides just the condensed field a little bit more difficult? Uh, well, I mean, it's, it's like you said, it's a condensed, condensed field. Uh, you know, defense can, can throw um, some uh, different uh, things at you, mm -hmm. um, stuff like that. But uh, so, stuff that I really don't think is a, <laughs> it's, it's a problem. You know, it's really all about us just, um, just punching it in, doing whatever we have to do, uh, whether it, it's, if it's throwing or running, getting in there. So I think that's all about us. The, the message of you guys just have to kind of be you and it's all about what you do on the field has been a pretty consistent one throughout the mm -hmm. locker room. Is that something that the coaching staff pushed or you guys just know if you play your game mm -hmm. and play it to the level that you can, you'll be successful? Yeah, I think we I think it's something that we definitely know. Um, and obviously, you know, the coaches say it, we all say it just because it's it's evident. You know, it's evident when we play our style of, uh, of football um, with our confidence and, and with the players that we have, it's evident that good things happen, you know. Um, so uh, we just have to get back to that and, um, and we'll be good. How hard is it to find that consistency in the NFL? Uh, I mean, I don't, I don't think it's, I don't think it's sh it should be hard, you know. Once we, uh, um, and that's the thing, it's like each each individual, um, you know, ha has to do his job, and and when we do that collectively, um, offense, defense, special teams, you know, uh, we're gonna be good, you know. And that's that's the same throughout the whole uh, the whole uh, NFL, you know. So um, I don't, I don't think it's hard, but. They get paid too, and um, and they're not they're another team that probably says the same things, you know. So uh, sometimes you uh, you know you falter a little bit, but um, the team that does it less is the team that comes out uh, on top. So we want to be that team that we know we are every game, um, and um, we'll we'll see we'll see a change and we'll see a, a shift of and it will be it'll be like that for for the long haul. So that's our goal um, to worry about us and what we do and um, worry about putting the best us on that field. So. All right, this is the last time you all see the Colts this season. How, how nice would it be to be able to sweep a division opponent? Oh, it would be great. You know, every time you, you sweep a division opponent, um, you know, it's, it's just great. It's great for the team, you know. So, um, obviously, you know, they're a team that, uh, that, that, you know, everybody's used to everybody when you play them twice a year and stuff. Um, but we want to be the ones that 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 close that close the deal that seals the, seals the deal, you know. So and I know that they're they're on the other side saying that too. But um, you know, when you do that to a division opponent, um, obviously it's, it's it's very important, um, you know, to you know the growth of your team and at the, towards the end of the year when everything counts.